Welcome back to some more War on the Sea Pacific Theater Mod. Uh, we're on part 228. Uh, let's get ready. Uh, how is everybody doing today? In the conclusion of your weekend, um, if you're watching this as I post, um, if not, you're, you're, you're having a great day, whenever, whatever day that is. So let's look into what's going on. <clears throat> we have a stopgap waiting period here and what that waiting period is until we can uh, get rearmed over here again get supplies over to Wake Island uh, we have supplies here but as you see we're a little broken um, let's get some of these guys out of here I think we can get some out let's what's the most important ones that we want to do um, Hong Kong I think um, needs to be addressed I think we can send over and upgrade this this here um, to a level two airfield. So let's get Hong Kong uh, on the docket on this slow boat from China here. Let, let's uh, load you up. Now, hmm, what are we doing here? Let me see. Wait, why, where are you not there? Are you fully loaded? No, you're not fully loaded. Um, we're gonna, well, you're going somewhere, but we stopped you for some reason. So, where do we want to go to steal? We're gonna go over here, I think. Um, no, we're not. It was a good place to go. Yeah, that's where we're going. So, um... Let's go over here. I'm gonna steal off of uh, Guam a little bit, I think. Uh, I really didn't want to, but um, I don't know. See, that's the point here, is that um, we look at Wake, okay? And we have so many troops here and 10,000 less uh, supplies. Um, we really need, need to start even Steven and this guy off. Maybe we'll bring some of these guys back over here. We can bring some troops. There's about a 3,000 troop supply thing going on. Um, New Guinea. out of here um, the importance right now is to get <clears throat> is to get um... you like it when I pause like that I know it bothers me too is to get things moving right we need to get things moving in, into a location so, Sarong, what's your status? Alright, so we're, we're looking to build this up here. Um, so let's get this New Guinea supply over to Sarong. <laughs> Guinea or Ganaya? Uh, uh, is it Ganaya? Guyana? Guyana? That's in Africa, I think. Um, It's all good. Yeah, do your thing, boys. Let's get over there. Let's get this ball rolling a little bit. Uh, Avengers, assemble. Um, where are you, my friend? 
All right, so we got enough aircraft to take care of this guy, I think. And this is the Taffy 3 group. I think. Let's begin. Yep, this is still Taffy 3. So, um, we're not really going to do much here. We're just going to, I think, activate uh, Avengers. As you see here, these guys are coming in to uh, do damage on our ships. Okay, fighters getting shot down by dive bombers. Alright, got rid of them. Any more? These guys are way too close, my friends. We could lose a carrier here. Um, please. That was pretty lucky. If he had gone for this guy, we would have had a ball. Oh. Let's see what that was. Alright, little uh, splash damage. No problem. Oh, you got hit. I missed that one. My plane's direct hit by bomb. Well, that's the thing. This one's been targeted quite a bit here. Surprised I didn't hear that. This fire out, boys. So these two um, compartments are flooded permanent. They're not going to get repaired. So our speed is probably going to stay at 88. taken care of and then we'll get out of here oh so that's where we get into problems um, come on damage control boys let's stop this fire before it spreads now this flooding will get repaired um, but this one yeah there we go good job so the flooding is taken care of. Now we're just repairing the bulkheads. So what we're go going to do is we're going to do a, a switch, I think. You know, do we, do we uh, change the order of our, our ships here? Or th these ships? I don't think so. All right, let's get out. Twelve to twelve, one loss of aircraft, and um, where you go? Oh, you're Essex. Gotcha. No, no, no. That wasn't what we were doing. Oh, this is get these guys up here. Yeah, so they're still working their way down this chain. Um, okay, the other group is being attacked. Uh, that's a problem because... Oh, we got some Hellcats right over the top. We're good. Okay. Wow. So these guys are torpedo planes and they spawned right over our ships. Just kind of sad. Um, let's see if we can get our ships into in uh, the battle here. And I want 
St. Low to uh, do a turn. We have guns on the sides. We want to get into the game. So it looks to me like we've lost a few aircraft. Uh, aircraft. Yeah. Yeah, two fighters. <clears throat> That's not cool. That's not cool, man. Look at all these fighters we're losing. I don't like that. That doesn't make sense. You know, your fighters are are just totally getting taken out. Unacceptable losses for fighters against torpedo planes. But uh, it is what it is, right? So we lost seven fighters to their six torpedo planes. Not cool. Not cool, man. Again, we're playing the scenario of uh, transporting aircraft to um, Ford locations. I'm gonna get hit. This is gonna get hit all the way through. <clears throat> okay. And again, we're not launching up any more aircraft. We're just going with what we have. So Avengers seem to need to get in the game here. Let, let's uh, put you guys on, on docket. Should be everybody. Kind of want you guys to go faster though. Avenger down. Oh, that was close right there. Yeah, look at that. I wonder if we got damaged. No, no damage. Mm. 
status. One aircraft remaining. Where are you? <coughs> Come on, boys. This is you. It's all you, my friend. There we go. One of these guys is uh, struggling for ammo, I think. No, nope. we got ammo. So we lost another fighter, or another Avenger. No fighters. It's good. But this is gonna be a attrition thing. So this, these are transport aircraft, so we're not going to launch them. We're going to see if we can keep that going. <coughs> Excuse me. Taffy 3. So I did have a comment. Um, it's from an earlier video in the series, and I don't remember where it was. Let's see if we got resupplied over here, which we did. Um, first things first is Subwake needs to manage cargo and let's uh, go even here. course you down here to Wake Island and as we do that uh, we have to do the uh, Midway you're gonna go back make sure you're unloaded of course back to Midway that's probably the most efficient supply route we have um, one ship coming and one ship going type of thing um, we do need to uh, what, what's this guy you will uh, Supply strip group. Um, what were we doing with you? I forgot. I think we were looking for upping these guys. Um, Which is more important? Um, you have Corsairs. I think we wanted to go there. Um, Saipan has, yeah, Wildcats. So, yeah, it's only one and two. But we're, we're gonna Guam up first, so let's do that. So, not that one. This one. Supply, engineering, and uh, fuel. Look at all that fuel. Jeez. I think that's what we want. Um, let's do it. Yeah, with um, the Cimarrons that take 150 fuel, we don't have enough fuel over here to even bother with that. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to say, we'll take one of you. So that means one, two, three four ships are going to go to Guam. So let's split you off. <coughs> All these randoms we got going on here. Why is this pop up again? 
me fix that. All right, I just noticed that. Is that up for a reason? Well, let's see if we can fix this. Sorry about this, guys. Um, all right, where did we fix this last time? Overlay. In-game overlay preferences. We should, that should never show up again, right? Still has my recording. That's all I want is this recording mic to show that I'm still recording. That's all. All right, fix that. Um, so this group here, what do we want to do with you? Um, we have you guys coming in. I think we want to set you aside. Um, We're gonna we're gonna put you guys over here because we don't have the supplies to to fill this right now. So you guys are gonna have to wait. The other group can go off and help out uh, Guam. We'll get another f level five airfield over there, and we'll be good. We should get another hit over here somewhere. I'm pretty sure. How many aircraft we got over here? What are you guys doing? We need to up this because you're getting a little close. Getting close to uh, nighttime here. Um, we're gonna lose our cap pretty shortly. These guys are getting a little close to uh, danger zone. I expect to see an aircraft here. What are you guys doing? I don't like you being that close. So we're on the back end of the uh, Taffy 3 experiment. <coughs> what else we got going on? Uh, Sup Manila. you up with with supplies and you're going over here no 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 wow look at that woof we need supplies that's all we need let's let's go supplies but we're gonna take off troops anyway just because um manage cargo so Not gonna take any fuel this time around. We're just gonna go with that. And we're gonna course you all the way down here to the, our marked locations. Do that, my friend. You know, the slow trickle of supply groups coming out of here. We got what, Causeray left? We still doing the cause right thing? If so, why? Yeah, engineering's heavy. We need one more fuel. Th that'll put us over 300 for 150. 150, 180 is 330. <coughs> Let's send you off. 
Oh, look at you. That's broken. Okay. Well, we'll do. We'll not do that then. Um. See if we can get fuel for well, do we need yeah, we need some fuel, don't we? Pompeii. Let's go grab your fuel, my friend. So we're gonna come over here. Go kaboomba. And then we'll remember to come over here and do that. So two hundred <coughs> No, that doesn't work either. So two hundred engineering well, those two ships we have have 100 engineering on each, and there's two of them, so that's 200 engineering, so that's 251. That's not over 300, so we're going to pick up more engineering here. Yeah, we'll try. I don't know if we can, but we'll see. Um... I'll work it. We'll see what happens. Happy Three is getting excited again. Um, yeah, we should be good. I don't like how they're getting infiltrated so close. Um, but, hey, that's a thing. White Plains is pretty well damaged. Um, Kitma's got six damaged compartments. One nothing. You guys need to step up, my friends. Alright, let's see what we got here and how close they are. At least we have these guys that are kind of close, but this is supposed to be three groups of four, eight, twelve. I believe there should be eighteen aircraft in this group, but I don't know. So activate the Avengers so that they can do their thing. Look at how close they are. How jacked up is that? So, we have to uh, discourage them. And by discourage, I mean do whatever we can to... Let's do, let's do this. Um, Dennis, you need to go this way as well. Everybody else can kind of do their thing. Now, what are what type? Oh, okay, these are land-based, non-kamikaze. <clears throat> Let's see what happens. Going after this guy. Let's see if we can turn out of there quick enough. So they got their bombs away, but we're going to be able to evade. A little dinger there. Not bad. Um, red is okay. We can repair that. Um, if it was black, it would be a problem. This is just splash damage, should be okay. 
Hellcats, are you trying? Or are you just, uh... Nice angle of attack, my friends. All of you. <coughs> mindless drones, mindless drones. So, what did we do with this angle here? Um, as you see, everybody turned. What was the damage here? Not you. You. Let's get this guy fixed. I don't recall what this formation was. I think it was battle line, but we'll see. Yep, you're dumb. This guy here. Hey, Captain, dumbass. Yeah, you're fired, my friend. You, you're definitely fired. Um, what do I have to say about that? Well, you're fired. And I'm not making a reference to anybody by saying that. I'm just like, Captain's Mast for that sucker. So, uh, let's go back and look at the damaged ship. We fixed already? Is she right? Yeah, it was this one. So, integrity on, the, on that forward hangar or elevator. Actually, it's rear elevator, in it? It's bow stern. This elevator. So this rear elevator got hit and caused some considerable damage, but we could still launch aircraft off of this guy, but... We're not. We're transporting aircraft. So let's just get on with it. Shall we? Six down, no losses. I'm okay with that. How did they get so close into us? I don't know. Um, we are going to set up a... A Taffy 3 scout. And I want these guys to be right around us. This Kitma Bay, we're not touching... You have yours up. We're going to put up your scout planes. Avenger action. And I want you guys to be empty. And I kind of want you guys just to... We want them to stay up. I'm not even approaching 100 miles yet. We just did that, so that should be right over the ships. Let's see how this works out for us. So that uh, resupply that we just had appears to be we're in a better position right now with resupply coming um, again. We really can't take any more off of here because we'd just be in the same situation we were before. Um, Wake Island is bad broken. Um, these guys are coming in. No, these guys. Yeah, you're just going Saipan and back and forth. These are the guys. Okinawa group. These guys are coming in to uh, replenish, repair their carriers. So, one uh, Independence class carrier. And what's the other one? This is a Casablanca. 
with only one air, one fighter left on it. So both of those are going to go into repair, and um, yeah, hopefully that will happen sooner than later. So these guys are on the down swell of. Uh, don't like this little ditch there, but whatever. Four C, uh, what's your status? I don't think this guy's moving anymore. See if we can get him moving again, doing something that's worthwhile. We really just want to cover this from being resupplied. Um, we attacked it once. One and one is not a big threat, but that's our next invasion location. So we really want to take care of that. How are we doing at some of these other locations? Anybody else? And there's no engineering or fuel over here, but they're fine. You're fine. Look at all the fuel they got over here. It's a status there. Why do we need fuel there, my friend? And far too many supplies. Coaching Defense Force. Um, who else is over here? An awful lot of supplies over there. These locations, yeah, we want to up them for command point purposes. But thing is oh yeah this is the issue okay so at that location we had this no 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 not this one what was it yeah we started to talk and then I stopped talking um, what was that location You guys? Yeah. So somebody asked, um, what were the markings? Uh, what country does this? I think it's Dutch, now that I think about it. Whenever I see orange, I think Dutch. Um, Australians looks more like a British flag, or B British coloring, uh, but these are British aircraft. You see that the roundels have been darkened out, so I think this triangle meant Dutch. You see the... Uh, British roundel here has been blackened out or painted over, painted over. So they painted this triangle so that they'd be easily represented as um, allied aircraft. So I believe it's a Dutch symbol. Um, but yeah, the, the person that commented was on a much older video uh, in the series. Or, yeah, 177 or something like that. And um, they want to know what were the markings on this aircraft. And I, I said, I think it's Australian, but I'm not sure. And now looking at it, it's not Australian, it's Dutch. It's my next best guess. So you guys can go and have fun.
A little broken on this uh, organi organization there. Um, a little bit all over the place. This this one's kind of as I load these guys up and move them out. totally didn't even cover my normal routine of of uh, tr so troop supplies, troop supplies, troop supplies to keep that balance. So this is one's all over the place. This is one of those dump everything you got on any ship you got and send them off to do their thing. And uh, uh, what are you guys doing? At least this one looks somewhat, somewhat even. I keep getting these out of order. I think that's everybody. Um, is there Manila Defense Force? Where are you guys at? There you are. So you guys need to uh, course your butt over here and pick up those guys. What do you got on you? Nothing. Nothing. That's fine. So yeah, you, you're seeing it now. I'm prepping to send off uh, to Manila a landing. One of many, probably. And you guys, Port-au-Prince, Supply, uh, you need to go back somewhere. do that my friends let's get this other day in donkeys donkeys hey we got a donk donks devils alert here that we haven't seen them participate in quite a while what do you guys got full compliment you guys are fresh fresh off the docks all your guns all your guns yeah all your guns, all your torpedoes, and this says probably three ships. And we're at 21, 29. So nighttime surface action. We need to look for uh, guns. We don't want to throw away a, another s s submarine like we did in a couple episodes ago. So we're going to start. And the first thing we're going to do, it's actually not that bad. There's a good moon today. Look at that. Let's get our uh, our scope up. Turn our radar on and see if we can find these ships. They're probably up here somewhere. All right, let's do it this way. Crikeys. One, two, three. At 1.30. So we need to do heading of uh, that's the best way to do this. My head is not working good today. No, that's that's a thing. So we're gonna go this way.
So these are older supply ships. I don't think there's guns on this guy or this guy. But we're going to see. If there's no guns, we're going to surface and just attack <coughs> at will and let them do their thing. <coughs> We're in a good position. We're ahead of them. It's a great night. Seas are okay. What's the sea state? Go to menu. Well, it's a rough... It's a wavy sea state, but I think we'll be good. I don't know if I'd want to be on deck shooting the gun, but that might be um, reason to uh, be wary of having the uh, guys on deck but these guys are tough you don't make them like that anymore so we're gonna do that let's uh let's see what we got let's take another look all right let's go see the ships so we're looking for deck guns if there are no deck guns, we just go in and light these guys up. So these guys have what they wanted to put deck guns on. That's what these mounts were, but there's no guns. So, um... <coughs> we're gonna do a... Let's just do this. Get those guys over there. Scope up. Turn your radar on. Go up, up. You turn your radar on. So we're going to say, number one, I want you to go after... Have one... Everybody go after the, the ship of their number. Um, and you're going to be shooting... Let's do this right. Number two, you're going after number two. Number three, you're going after number three. So we go to one and we say, what are you? You are this fancy uh, supply ship. Short stack, yellow and blue, right there. Number two, <laughs> you are the four cargo uh, mid, mid and aft stern. So, let's see if we can find you. Which I think is that guy. Yeah. You flip it the way the picture shows. See the uh, orientation. And number three, you're going after this guy. You're the older cargo ship that has the, uh, the, uh, what do they call it? The bullseye. This guy right here, the flag. Right. I don't know if you can see it. This side you can. There you go. And that's what you are. So we're looking at the range here. Everybody's kind of lining up, doing their thing. Let's see if we can get closer. What's the uh, orientation? <laughs> 
I'm just gonna let these guys get closer because I really just want to have them get in there and do their thing. And they're not going fast. We're not going fast either, but as soon as we get up on the surface, we'll be going faster. But I also like separation from the whale and the bowfin. And uh, we'll see if we can make that happen. So if we were going to think about uh, attacking, we're going to attack number three first. So you, and I want you to... Uh, It's kind of dangerous. All right, let's go back to normal speed and uh, surface the boat. As soon as I see a star shell, we're going to go off star shells. Hold. I'm going to go to HE, because that's where we have the most. And now we're going to go with number one. So the whale, you're going to go up on deck, surface the boat. We do the same thing with you. You're going to go HE, spot. fire and I want you to uh, head this way so now that we got you taken care of let's hold you go to HE spot fire and then number two bowfin I want you up on the deck And we're gonna do the same thing with you. Star shells, hold. Fire. All right, there's one star shell gone. One more. Okay, hold, go to HE. Fire. Let's see what the ships are doing. So once we get to a high round here, uh, we're going to go narrow. Take off spot, let them shoot faster. Well, I want you to do the same thing. So we're on narrow off on spot yep And then we just sit back and watch and let these guys do their thing. These guys are all trying to run, but it's not going to help them. We are kind of in a tight group here. Our, our subs are pretty narrowly close um, to the enemy. That's a good hit. The other thing we can do is everybody put your scopes down. OK. 
Okay, so three, we're shooting in three. You're going to uh, um, cease fire. And we want you to uh, have you just go this way if we can. Really lucky not to uh, crash into any ships, please. subs coming right in like that. Now in theory this guy would be like totally in the wrong and this guy would be totally in the wrong for crossing in front of a shooting submarine. How about you just help out? And you, why not help out as well, since you're there? I should be gone any second now. Donk's devils are, are holding no backs. So we got three submarines attacking this one ship. Um, we're kind of expending too much ammunition. But they are hitting, so we'll let them continue. That should do you, my friends. So I want you guys all to uh, form up. you to go that way and let's all go to periscope depth and we will watch and see if they do that and I have a feeling they won't do that so they're all supposed to be following this guy's lead this guy's gonna go down and just take a look at what these other submarines do It's actually a very nice night. <laughs> nice the white caps going, some bow spritz going on. Great big moon. So this guy went down. You're not going down, are you? You're not. Two knuckleheads look like they're coming in to uh, collide, collision course. Let's do three columns so that they don't do something stupid. I 
they're gonna do something stupid. That's okay. Look at these boys. Yeah, the game should not do this. I, I'm not a fan of ships colliding in the night like two damsels in distress, um, pretending to be long lost lovers of some fucking Libertard Express. Yeah, man. That, this is totally uncool in my opinion. Um, they're not gonna hit, maybe, but it should never happen. Submarines doing this. Oh, she just missed, I think. Maybe, I don't know. Still too close. You, my friend, would get fired. You, my friend, would get fired if you did that in real life. But, is what it is. Okay. But we did well. We, we got our job done on a nice uh, full moon. Um, it's a treat. Three sinks, three more command points, undamaged ships. Uh, 40, 89, 16, 40, 95, and 18, 40, 91, and 19. Okay, not bad. About half our ammunition, HE gone. Um, not quite, but you know what I mean. A lot. Uh, Donks Devils, you keep doing what you're doing and be, be happy about it. Let's uh, maybe give you a little Corsi action and uh, we'll have you do this. Something like that, maybe? Actually, that's not good. Let's have you go. Something like that. That might not be good either, but who knows? Let's see. Let's get to the morning. I have to make an errand. We we'll go to the grocery store today on this fine Sunday and uh, think about what my Sunday meal is going to be. I think I'm in a mood for like a stew or something like that. Um, I've been eating soup for the last week. So, uh,. Up on the docket is uh, these guys, and um, we have to get our, our carrier here repaired uh, with some new... We need some aircraft on these, on these ships, so they have to go into the repair, release and repair, and get them back. Um, so usually for release and repair, it's three days for aircraft, and um, that's fine. Uh, but that's what they're gonna do and then we'll probably put the ships back together um, that we stole from them because there's only five in this group right now um, anybody that has any damage at all is gonna be released and we we'll replace them we have the command points to do so and uh, we might even put out another fleet and that would be kinda cool right so uh, we will do that in the next video. I hope you guys are enjoying these. Um, I'm at the back end of uh, being sick for about a week. I think it was last Thursday. Now we're on Sunday. So yeah, it's pretty rough. Um, maybe it was longer than that. Maybe I'm thinking, not thinking right. But uh, you guys know when I started complaining about being sick, I think it was three or four videos ago, but um, so maybe that's more than a week. But uh, I thank you for watching. Again, if, if you like the video, leave me a comment. Um, it boosts my my uh, enthusiasm if I know that you guys are liking what you're seeing. If you just want to comment and say, "Ah, oh, that was cool," you know, the explosions, explosions, or you know, I don't want to hear this. You know, everybody says. You know, communication is key, but if everybody complains about the same thing and, you know, that kind of thing, those kind of comments nobody wants to hear. Especially since I've said I don't know how to fix the, like, the sound delay. And I've asked for options on recording software for over 200 videos. Not one recommendation have I gotten. Um, 
But yeah, if you like what you see and you want to just pal around and say, hey, great video or yeah, that was cool or I like what you do in these videos, um, just to let me know um, that you enjoy watching these. Uh, it, all of this will depend on whether or not I start another series at the end of this one. Um, again, we talked about Abcom a little bit. I think that's probably what we're going to do next. That's next on the current download I have uh, for this mod. Um, we probably will experiment in the in the uh, in including more things like damage model. Um, hardness levels, you know, that kind of thing. Um, we can take recommendations, maybe, uh, when we get to that point. The first video will probably be a suggestions for the game mod and uh, what you guys want to see. Uh, but that's still probably 10, 15 videos away or more. Um, we want to get to a certain period in this game where we have all the historical ships in the game for this mod unlocked and in the fleet, which means late 44, September, I think. So that's quite a ways away. So uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, but for now, I'll say thanks for watching. We will see you in the next video and probably do one tomorrow. That's fine. And uh, again, thanks. I appreciate it. See you then.